So one of the first things that you're taught to do as a new teacher is straight out from the beginning of the year, set your expectations. But what exactly does it mean to set expectations and how do you do it? So I want you to think about these six things as you are planning to communicate your expectations to students. That your expectations are extremely direct and very explicit. Being very clear to students will really help to set them up for success and them knowing what exactly to do. Next is you wanna be very specific about the behaviors that you'd like to see the students engage in. Um, avoid at all costs being vague when you're working with students to set expectations in your classroom. Next is expectations should be repeated often and frequently in those rooms, especially at the beginning of the year. You're saying them just all the time, what it is that you want students to do. Next is making sure that the expectation is observable in some way. You might want to model for students what to do. Um, what I mean by this is if you ask the students to pay attention, what exactly does that look like? You know, is that observable? Asking students to face forward, eyes up front, pencils down, that's something that they can actually do versus a very vague term like pay attention. Next is tenacity, really being ready to tackle uh, resistance. How will you do that? So as you're planning for expectations, being ready, being prepared to address resistance in one way or another, it may not be intentional, they just didn't understand or didn't know, but how will you respond to that? And finally, a sense of positive expectancy. So making sure that students feel as if you, you feel they're going to meet your expectations.